Hey guys, so if you're lucky enough to see our last video where we're making bread, today we'll be making chicken risotto. First I'm going to add the cheese, which I have actually weighed out, but it could be a bit off, who knows. Let's go a bit more. That's alright, so next, I'm going to put the lid and the measuring cup on, and blend it for 10 seconds with no speed. So, and then we're going to blend it for 10 seconds, no temperature, at speed 10. So, let's go. So, now that the cheese has all been all blended up, I'm going to press next and then transfer it into another bowl. And it's really fine because there are actually like really quick blades in there, so which is really good. Uh, so, next, we're going to add two garlic cloves in. Next, and then 150 grams of leeks, but I'm also going to put in some onions because we don't actually have that many leeks, and at this time, you just have to do what you have to do. Right, there we go. 40 grams of olive oil. Okay, I'm going to leave it there because you should not forget to be under the oil. Put the lid on. And then chop at speed five. Um, and then I'm gonna do speed one for three minutes. And the temperature is 120 degrees. So it's sauteing. So now I'm gonna add some risotto rice. Oh my God, that is boiling. Very hot. Weighing it in. That's a good thing, it has an built in scale, so I can, I don't have to go put it in another bowl and stuff like that, which is really annoying when I cook, and I used to cook. Ow! So now I'm gonna put 60 grams of white wine, but actually I'll put Prosecco because that's what we have. We're just going to put the lid on, and this is the measuring cup, so that's what it says. Uh, again, it's three minutes at 120 degrees at speed two, which is the highest speed the last time. So there we go. Actually, I'm not going to add chicken because we had a roast and we had leftover chicken from that. So, yeah. Now I'm going to add 600 grams of water. Now this has got my stock cube in it. Um, the stock cube was actually made in the Thermomix. So you can freeze this and stuff, so it's really good and has, it's kind of like, you know that there's no added anything into it. So I'm going to add that, yeah, which is exactly 600 millilitres, so. <laughs> Mum, I don't know. That's good. Scoop it all in. Okay, so, three sprigs of fresh thyme, leaves only. No way. It's very traumatic. Uh, I'm not going to add any salt because <clears throat> you don't want it to be too salty. Just a bit of pepper. I can't be bothered to measure it, so, you know. I'm just going to go with that. Now put the lid on. And speed one, temperature 100. And yeah. Now I can tidy up. For 13 minutes. Stop the video. Do a TikTok. Are you filming? So while we wait, Rosa does a TikTok. I have a little drink because I'm not doing the work. So because our chicken was cooked, we added it in and for, so it cooked for about two minutes in with the risotto. So now because we don't have any spinach, I'm going to add some peas. So 100 grams, same thing, peas. Untouched by human hands, as we say in the family. And then I'm going to add all of this cheese in. That we grinded. 
grated earlier. Now I am going to stir gently with a spatula. So I'm going to actually take it out to do this because it will be a lot easier. Let's have a look. Okay. I'll just stir it out at the moment, Mum. Woo! So now I'm just going to stir it all in. Is it good? 